Hey guys, today we're back with another product review. And today on the channel, we'll be reviewing the Through Night flashlight. Stay tuned for this one. <laughs> All right, guys, we're back. Once again, today we're gonna to be reviewing the Through Night, uh, Through Night Flashlight. This is the T2 version. It will come in this right here, as you can see, just a cardboard box. Uh, seems to be very well built myself. I like it, as you can see. But anyway, getting to the light. Uh, your insides will look like this right here. Your light will come as such. We'll go ahead and set the light to the side for a second. Pull the rest of this out. It will come with a manual. Please screw down the light head and tail cap before use. We've already done that to make sure it's optional or operational for the review. Uh, dear customer, thank you for your purchase. You have a lanyard. You have a little holster for it with a belt loop on it. Let me set this to the side. And one of the best parts about this light, you have your USB uh, charging cord for it. So we'll go ahead and set everything to the side. So finally, in the light market, a lot of people have finally understood that you know, uh, people don't really want to go out and have to buy AA, AAA batteries or whatever else for their lights that they want something they can recharge in the car because almost every new car now made comes with a USB port in it and they want something to where they don't have to ever worry about the batteries going dead or whatever else, that all they have to do is take it and uh, plug it into a USB port. And that's something that ThruLight has uh, been listening to their customers and everything, because here on the side, if I can get it opened up, it's got a little rubber seal over it, so to make it as waterproof as possible. It's actually a very good rubber seal if I can get it open myself, just, there we go. It has a micro USB port here on it to where you can plug it in to any wall outlet or whatever else you have, and you can charge it fully there. So getting out the owner's manual, go ahead and switch to the English version. You have four different modes in this actually. You have low mode, or actually five, my bad. You do have five. You have, uh, or six if you include the strobe mode, sorry about that. You have a strobe, you have a firefly, you have a low, medium, high, and turbo. So how you get to these, uh, if you have it turned off, as you can see here, you hold it in for a few seconds and it goes into the firefly, or firefire mode. And the firefly mode is 0.3 lumens and it will last for 69 days on a full charge. So this is a light here. I know it's not a lot of light or whatever else, but in the dead of night, it's better than nothing. And if you find yourself out lost, this is the best one that you can use to make sure that you do not run out of light. So from there you have, if I can get it turned in the phone right here, there we go. There we go. There is the low, which is a 30 lumens and it will run for 77 hours on full charge. There is your medium and it will run for 30, uh, it will be 366 lumens, will run for 7.5 hours. There we go. And there's your high, and it will run for 17, or it will have 1,712 lumens, and um, it will run for that for three minutes, and then it will die down to 732 lumens, and that will run for 223 minutes. So what that does pretty much is that if it starts overheating after three yeah. minutes, it will calm itself down and drop to 732 lumens so it don't pretty much catch itself on fire. And then the big one and the best one about this light is the turbo mode which is actually 3,757 lumens, which is kind of unheard of whenever it comes to this small of a light. All you have to do is in any mode, it doesn't matter if it's in the off mode or on mode, you press it twice and you have the turbo mode, which like I said, 3,752 lumens for two minutes will drop down to 725 lumens and it will run for 216 minutes in that one. So uh, it has a distance of 158 meters max, uh, impact resistant at 1.5 meters, and is waterproof up to IPX-8, which is two meters. You also have a way on here to tell if it is, uh, how the battery is looking on the inside. From 21% uh, to 100%, whenever you turn it on, it's gonna be blue, as you can see right here. 
Whenever you have 11% to 20%, it will turn red. And when it goes from 1% to 10%, it will be a flashing red. So it will kind of warn you where uh, you are in the pattern, in the power mode. Also has a belt clip right here on it. If you want to straight up, just attach it to your belt. But uh, also has lanyard and the little holster for it. So guys, if you're interested in the through night flashlight, I've actually been uh, putting it through its paces and it worked very, very well through everything. Uh, but if you're all interested in this light, I'll leave a link in the description below that will take you straight to the store to where you can purchase this. Very nice light overall, very good design, ergonomic, and I really do like it a lot. But guys, like I said, if you're interested, check in the description below and it'll take you straight to it. But guys, appreciate y'all viewing. Like and subscribe for more gun reviews, knife reviews, product reviews, anything under the sun. And I will see y'all in the next video.